No problem. We, we, we say, okay, no problem. Find contradiction in errors. The Quran challenges human beings. Like I said to you before. So, there is, there is contradiction <coughs> there. show me. Um, you can make me literally, potentially, okay, I can't believe it. You know the verse in the Quran where it says to uh, be at peace with uh, Jews and Christians. Okay. Whatever. And, no, then, and then you'll, you'll find another verse, like Surah 9 verse 5. Yes. Slaughter all polytheists, Surah 9 okay. verse 29. Um, yes, okay, let's kill the people of the book, subdue them until they pay Jazia. Okay, let's talk about that. Okay, so Surah... Uh, so that's, a, that's a clear contradiction. One no, is saying, no, one not. is saying, oh, oh, be peaceful. The other one is saying, kill them. Okay, good. Okay, okay. okay. either it's a contradiction, or maybe on your behalf you haven't fully understood it, yeah? You're also talking about Surah Mumtahina verse 8, yeah? Okay, so first we'll go to Surah Mumtahina, yeah? Surah 9 verse 5. Before we go to that, oh, let's go to the verse that you're talking about, yeah? Surah Mumtaina, verse 8. I'm going to go to verse 8, yeah? Here's the verse, okay? <coughs> Indeed, for there is an excellent example in them. For anyone who hopes to meet Allah in the last day, and if one turns away, Allah is free of all needs, worthy of your praise. It is hoped that Allah will bring about love between you and those of them who you have enmity. Allah is powerful and Allah is most forgiving, very merciful. Allah does not forbid you as regards to those who did not fight you on account of your faith and did not expel you from your homes that you do good to them and deal justly with them. This in itself explains your point. Allah saying Muslims are not forbidden to be just and kind to those who did not fight us and kick us from our houses. Yeah. So the companions, the Muslims were persecuted, they were kicked and they were fought against. Yeah. So Allah's condition is this. As long as you do not fight me, attack me because of my faith, and kick me out my houses, Allah said I can be good and kind to you. Yeah? So now let's get this. I've got, I've got a verse that contradicts that. You can contradict that. But yeah. okay. Okay. Cool. another one, yeah, okay. Yeah. yeah, bring it, yeah. So the question here is this: if you attack me, I have a right to defend myself, yes? Mm -hmm. If I defend myself, am I bad? Am I contradicting this verse? No. Okay, so therefore there is no contradiction because this says there's conditions. If they don't attack you, then be good to them. If they so attack be, be you, no, no, it's look. Have you attacked me today? No. Then have I been harsh to you? Have I said no. kill him wherever you find him? Mm. Why not? Because this verse, Allah says, Allah does not forbid you from being just and kind to those who do not kick you on your faith, uh, uh, kick you out of your homes because of your faith. Do you persecute me because I'm a Muslim? No. And look, look at the next verse. Allah, look at look, look, Allah forbids you only about those who who fought you on your faith, account of your faith and expelled you from your homes and helped others in expelling you that you have friendship with them. So Allah said, Allah first he says, be kind and just to those who are good to you. Allah is only telling you to be harsh towards those who are fighting you and kicking you out of your houses because you're a Muslim. So why was, why was Muhammad the conqueror? Why? That's, that's, oh, one second. For example, Churchill, when the Nazis came and attacked him, should he blow kisses? Thank you, thank you, bomb us. That's... What should he do? You're, you're a commander. You're a yeah. commander, where are you from? Uh, Jamaica. You're in Jamaica, yeah? Yeah. You're from Jamaica, yeah? I'm Kurdish from Turkey, yeah? We come in, we come into your lands, yeah? What are you going to do? <laughs> um, well, if you're coming to attack, self-defense. Self-defense, yeah. not you're a terrorist. Uh, if I'm a terrorist? No, no, you're a terrorist for, attack, for defending your country. How? Exactly, that's my point. Wait. No, but, but Muhammad, he would conquer other countries. He would have, he would no, have just no, gone no, there no, for, no, no. One second. for defense. In his, no, no, no. When he was... If, for example, with the Jews, when they broke the treaty with him, yeah. uh, that was different because they allowed... They yes, allowed, yes, uh, yes, they broke it, yes, yes. But that's one example of him yeah. self-defense. Yeah. Yeah. There was other examples of him just conquering lands for the sake of conquering. No, that no, no, is, no, no. Okay, 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 no, no. That expansion, for example, you need to understand, that was when he, after he passed away, yeah? Okay, if I'm not saying after he passed away. Conquering lands, Today, and today, yeah. today, no, 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 slaughtering which polytheists? One second, which polytheists are you talking about? Let's go to, let's go to Surah Toba, yeah? The, the, the policy that you're talking about, yeah? Thank you, man. Go to verse 13, yeah? Look what Allah SWT says. Would you not fight a people who broke their oaths and conspired to expel the messenger? And it was they who started fighting against you for the first time. So what's the context? Allah saying, are you not going to fight those who were trying to expel you and trying to kill you. Let's go to Surah Anfal, yeah? Let's go to Surah Anfal, I've got, and you to understand the context, yeah? I'm gonna to go to Surah Anfal, I'm gonna to go to verse 30, yeah? And recall, and Allah says to the Prophet, and do you remember when the disbelievers were conspiring against you to hold you as a captive or to kill you? So what were, they, what were the disbelievers doing? They were plotting to kill the Prophet when he was in Mecca, yeah? What does verse 13 say? Let's go to verse 13. What does verse 13 say? 
Would you not fight a group of people who broke their oaths? They broke the treaty. They killed Muslims and expelled the messenger. And it was they who started fighting you first. Do you know what was the first verse revealed about fighting? Surah Hajj. Yeah? Surah Hajj, verse 39. These are all contexts. When you look into it, the matter of context, there is no denying it. This is 39. When this was revealed, Abu Bakr radiallahu an said, I knew at this time they were being persecuted for years, 10 to 12 years. He said, this verse came down. And look at what the verse says, yeah? Permission to fight is given to those against whom fighting is launched. You know what this means? Abdullah ibn Abbas as well, yeah? He said that when this was revealed, they knew that they could defend themselves now. Because what does it say? If I say to you, I give you permission now, you can go. That means before I did not give you permission. Now I'm saying, I'll give you permission now, you can go. Yeah? So okay. here, all of these verses that you're talking about, what's it talking about? Let's go to so let's go to five, yeah? So when the sacred mounts expire, kill the mushrics wherever you find them and catch them and besiege them. Who are the mushrics? Do you know who the mushrics are? These are people, no, not just polytheists. They're, they're not just your any polytheist, yeah? These are enemy combatants. <coughs> I come, kick you from your house, kill your mom, kill your brother. What are you going to do? Defend myself. Okay. Are you, are you? Muhammad done the very same thing. Uh, what's his, uh, I think it was Sophia. Yeah. Uh, captured in war. Yes. Killed, killed the husband. Killed the brother. Married her. And killed the day. father. I killed and the killed father. I'll make it better for you. Yeah. And yeah. killed the father. Yeah. And killed the father. Yes. And then she yeah. willingly. Yes. Married him. The very yes. Same because way. because in the hadith there's a narration. This was asked to me I mean, when just, I confronted I mean, Tommy like, From like a logical, like common sense point of view. Mm. If I, I, I kill you, I kill your, let's say, for example, you yeah, have no, I, 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 I kill I, I, all I, of them. I understand your, uh, yeah. your thing, yeah? yeah cool. But do you see that every question, I'm going to answer that as well, no yeah. problem. But I'm just trying to make a point here. Even that, we have narrations from Bukhari or Muslim that the Prophet gave her an option. He said, if you want, I will free you, you can go back to your tribe. Or if you want, you can marry me, yes, and I will make you my wife. Which one did she choose? Do you really think that that? Mm -hmm. No, no, this, 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 see, this doesn't work with. Okay, what do you think? Because I didn't think even before that, Sophia, Radiallahu Anha, was saying that she had the dream about the Prophet. Yeah? Now, you might say, hold on a second, that doesn't make sense, or whatever. The issue is that she even had marks on her face from a slap across her face because she said that she had the dream of a bright moon. Yeah? And who does the moon signify? We believe it signifies the Prophet, peace be upon him. Yeah? She had the dream about the Prophet. In our narrations and hadith, we don't, we, it's very clear. The Prophet married Aisha at six, yeah? Do we hide that? No. We make it very clear, yeah? So then why would we twist Sophia's issue? We wouldn't. So Sophia's issue, she gave him two options. He gave him. The Prophet said, if you want, I can free you, you can go back to your tribe. And why did he kill the father, the brother and the husband? Why? Why? After the, the, they broke the treaty, yeah, in uh, the battle of... Um, <laughs> <laughs> you can record from here. Anyways, at the battle of uh, the battle of Khandak, yeah, the battle of the trench, they betrayed the prophet. Then uh, some of them, Ben Qurayda, some of them, they flew, they flee, they they fled uh, to. Um, Assalamualaikum, sister. Anyways, Young says we have to excuse them. But anyways. They, fl they flee to uh, Khaybar, yeah? And in Khaybar, of course the Prophet's gonna come, yeah? There was a war. You can't blame, oh, he killed the father. What do you want to do? Kiss him in the head? Somebody who's betrayed the Prophet, who's conspired against him, yeah? So I think I have answered a lot of your questions that you threw at me, all of them, yeah? All of them I've answered it. Now I want to go back to you. I think it's only fair, yeah? Everything that you mentioned, there's a context and I've explained. And none of it disproves the Quran. None of it. None of it disproves the Quran. You cannot come and say, oh, the Prophet went and killed the father, the husband, and this time because uh, that's why uh, the Quran is not from God. No, it doesn't. In, in a way, it does. No, it doesn't. So, so, so I'll tell you why. Because why? if you look at, like, um, you believe that the Muslims came after the Christians, after the Jews, yeah. as the final message. Yes. And in the Bible, it tells us uh, the criteria of what the Prophet would be. Uh, the Prophet will come through the line of Jacob. No, 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 no. Why Jacob? would he even come to Jacob? Come through the line of Jacob, from the line no, of Israel. No, but it says, it says that in the Bible. No, no. How do you know your Bible is the word of God? That's the thing. Anything that you're quoting from the Bible, we need to first establish, before I go anywhere close to the Bible, 
I want you to prove to me the Bible is the word of God. I've told you about the haptatic structure. No, 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 no. That, no. Is a, that in itself is a miracle. No, 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 no. Wait, no, 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 no one second. Do you accept that you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight different Bibles with different amount of books in it? I only follow the Protestant version. No problem, but that's my point. The fact that you're saying you follow the Protestant version is my argument that how do you have, how could you say the Bible that I have is the word of God, but the rest are not? Because the rest are saying the same to you. The Catholics are saying the same to you. They're saying you are on something else. The books that we have is the right one. How does that not prove to you that this cannot be the word of God? That's number one. Let me go to verses. These are books. Matthew chapter 17 verse 21, Matthew chapter 18 verse 11, Matthew chapter verse 23 verse 14, Mark chapter 7 verse 16, Acts chapter 8 verse 37, Romans chapter 16 verse 24. What are the variations? Luke, not variations, the variations brother. All of these are verses added in that do not belong there. <laughs> What's your evidence for that? There are the evidence, open it. It will tell you in the footnote, look. I'll go to Bible Gateway, yeah? Watch this. I'm going to Bible Gateway and what I'm going to do now Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to go through one by one, yeah? I believe you're sincere and genuine, yeah? Okay, so we're going to go through them. Matthew chapter 17, go to Bible Gateway please. Can someone open Bible Gateway? It's, it's, it's called Bible Gateway. Open it, yeah? I'm going to write here Matthew 17. Matthew 17. Verse 21, yeah? King James, King James Version, yeah? Open Matthew chapter 17 verse 21, King James Version, yeah? Is that Bible Gateway? Yeah. Okay. Okay, stay there, yeah? Just wait for mine to load. load. Use my phone. My okay. Bible gateway. Okay, one second. Let me do this. Okay, I'm gonna open Matthew. <laughs> One second. Uh, right, Matthew here. Seventeen. Okay. I'm gonna go to Matthew chapter seventeen. Basically, in my school, I went to school right okay. after Parliament. Yeah, so, um, okay. I'm, me and my friend are head of the Interfaith Dialogue. So every Monday, we will talk about the Bible. He'll talk about Quran, I'll talk about the Bible. Uh, yeah. Okay, read King James Version. Uh, How be it this kind goeth not out but by prayer and fasting. Okay, this is New International Version, yeah? Where's the international version? That is that is uh, that is unreliable. Though. That's unreliable. Okay, version. good, good, good. Okay, so 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 one second. Yeah, that's unreliable. It, this that's, that's undisputed. Between, no, 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 like, not disputed. No, no, no. The verse doesn't. The verse is not there. It doesn't exist. And I agree with you. No, but that's my point. I agree with you. I you're, you're not saying I actually agree with you. Yeah. The major. Let's say let's say the majority of Muslims uh, believe that if we should, uh, like the majority of Muslims are Sunnis. For yeah. example, we yeah. believe the code this way. Major, um, you have a small percentage of like Ahmadis. They're not, they're not Muslims. They're not. Yeah, exactly. They're not Muslims. No, no, they're not Muslims. They're separate. You see, you see that exactly. With King James Version, no, it's all the same Quran. Like, so with King James Version, 
99% of Christians, King James Version. This version. No, 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 this no, version, no. no. This version was. No, no, you can't say 99% of the King James Version. This version was, was created. No, 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 you can't say that. This version was. was this version was all. This, this Catholics. Does a Catholic take the 66 books? Hmm? Does a Catholic take the 66 books? Majority of the uh, Christians are Catholics. If I'm not mistaken, there's, I'm very there's, sure. There's, there's so you can't say 99% of them are uh, take the King James. The fact that you're telling me this is my <coughs> is my evidence. You're t there's a verse missing in here. You're saying this is my point. You've just that even one doesn't line up with the manuscripts. King James version no, 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 no. The, King James version. The ones who check the manuscripts, yeah, they say these verses do not belong there. It's not there. That's the this you know what this came. Look, this, this came from. Vatican, Vaticanus, which was created by the Catholics. No, 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 it's not this. Not no, 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 it's this, this, this. Look, John chapter 7, yeah? Look, I'll show you the same thing, yeah? The fact that you're saying this is, a, is, is an evidence to me, yeah? It shows that the Bible is not reliable because you're saying, yeah, it's, it's how is it? Okay, just do we I have, have... We have a version that lines up with all no, the no, no, you don't, do, no, you don't. Do. There's, the earliest manuscripts do not have the verses you're talking about. They, they're not... They Dead Sea Scrolls. No problem. They, they, dead, dead Sea Scrolls. How is it? Dead Sea Scrolls is the Old Testament. It's Old Testament. I'm talking about New Testament. John okay. chapter 7, look, look. Yeah? John chapter 7, verse 53, yeah? But what you're saying is not anything new to me. No, 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 but it's not. Christians do not follow No, no, then, 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 follow the then, then what you're doing is you're drinking that poison water. That's what you're doing. And they said, yes, you are. The earliest manuscripts and many other ancient witnesses do not have John 7, 5, 3 to Mark 8, 11. You don't have it. I've got proof again. No problem. No, where's your proof? I mean, I've researched it. I've, okay, where? I myself, I've researched the King James Version, I've researched the NIV. Okay. And the King James Version is the reliable version. No, so no, how, how do you know that? You're coming to me with old news. How do you know that? No, no, it's not old news. This is actually, this is old news with very valid points, you can call it. Tell me, John chapter 7 verse 5, 3 does not exist in the oldest manuscripts. How are you relying your I don't soul... Have them with me right now, but... Sorry? I don't have them with me right now. But no, 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 it's not, it's not that. How are you relying... How are you relying your hereafter, your soul, on scripture that has books, 20 books added in? Let alone, I'm giving you one verse. And you're saying, oh no, I'm saying there's 20 books. Nathaniel, this is... Look, you can deny it. My job is you can take it, you cannot take it. It's up to you. All I'm saying is, it's very clear, you take it or you don't take it. You're going to be accountable on the Day of Judgment. God's going to ask you. The message was delivered to you. He's telling you clearly. The earliest manuscripts do not have this. Do you, do you follow Jay Smith? Do you know Jay Smith? He used to come to the park? Oh yeah. Do you think, is he really the King James? I think, I, I believe so. Yes, he, he believes this. He goes, yes, they, they, we don't have it in the earliest manuscripts. He accepts it. Jay Smith. Jay Smith. Jay Smith by word, by his own word and tongue. He says, yes, we don't have the earliest manuscripts. <laughs> I'd have to do more research. No, you need to do more research. But the issue here is this, Nathaniel, yeah? This is your hereafter. Yeah? This is your hereafter at risk, yeah? Now, all we're saying to you is, worship God and God alone. God has no partners. God is not a man. A man was infallible. A, a man was finite. He had to eat. Jesus had to eat food. Jesus was on the cross dying. Are you telling me the one who created the heavens and the earth um, d died on the cross? Really? And he, he claimed divinity. No. The, the, once again. Jesus did claim divinity. Once again, it goes back to the Bible. If you cannot prove the Bible is the word of God, nothing you tell me in the Bible, I'll accept it. You can't prove the Quran is God. Yes, it is. And you tried it. I told you, bring an evidence around. Are you are you are you replying? Are you listening to reply or listening to understand? Because to me it just seems you've just programmed. Okay, if they say this, say that. You're not listening to understand. You're listening to reply. Show me a verse in the Quran. What I showed you. Show me one verse in the Quran that we have that's been taken out. That we can say by 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 men. That's been changed. You know, the thing is, if you if you think about it, where do we get the Quran from? Muhammad. No. Muhammad uh, revealed to Muhammad. It was revealed to him. Yes. Okay, so. If we can prove, what if we can prove that Muhammad is not a prophet? I'll leave Islam. And then what if we can prove that he, he doesn't follow the biblical... Uh... No, no, who said he needs to follow the biblical... No, one second. Firstly... Because I've heard from many Muslims, oh, yeah. Muhammad was prophesied in uh, Deuteronomy, Muhammad was prophesied in... Maybe, we can say we can say similarities, but I don't go there. You know why I don't go there? Because I know if I go there, you're going to bring something else. Is the Bible the word of God? No? Sorry. 
then, then there's problems in it. Nothing's reliable. There's nothing that's reliable in there. Well, by your same logic, there's no proof that the Quran is the one for Like I said to you, the Quran says, bring you evidence. Bring you evidence. Are you just denying it? What, 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 on what basis are you denying it? Have you read the Quran? Not all of it. Okay, then how are you denying something you haven't read? Because I've, I've already got the truth. No, there you go. See? How do you know you've got the truth? There's just... It's... You, you, you know what I mean. No, no, no. How do you know what? Is it? Is it um, subjective experience? How, how do you know you have the truth? Do you know what I'm trying to say? I'm yeah, just saying. I know, I, know, I know what you're trying to say. I'm that's, just saying how. That's more. That's more of a. You can't really answer that in one in one sentence. How do you know you have the truth? Like no, it's, it's more of like. It's well, it's it's subjective. Do you get it? What I'm trying to say to you. I don't. I don't think truth is really, I think there's only absolute truth. I don't think there's like your truth and my truth. Think okay, but but but, but but how? Do, yes, you're right. I agree with you. But how do you know the truth that you're on is the truth? How do you know? But how do you, I could ask you the very same question. I'm not asking the same question. No problem. I believe why I'm on, uh, why I believe Islam is the truth is very simple. Yeah, 